Hi everyone, welcome back to our weekly video blog. Uh, today we're going to be talking about in-office liposuction. Well, the liposuction we do in the operating room is really reserved for high volume liposuction, uh, liposuction where you're taking out a lot of fat and also you're using a lot of tumescence which is the um, anesthetic fluid that we use to numb up the area before we do liposuction. The, in the office we do, I, I limit my in-office liposuction to one to two areas and I don't like to use um, usually more than two liters of tumescence in the office. I usually reserve it to two body parts, either the abdomen and the flanks or the flanks and the back area or the abdomen and the neck. So I just, we pick two body parts and that's what we do in the office. The patient is awake the whole time they're relaxed either with some Valium or pain medication and we really reserve in-office liposuction for completely healthy patients. We don't really do this in the office for any patient that has any type of medical condition um, and we usually reserve it for relatively young patients so that uh, there's no issues. The advantages of the in-office lipo, I think the, one of the major advantages is that in our office we have the Vaser ultrasonic liposuction machine, which basically is one of the best machines for liposuction and lipo contouring. What it is is it you inject the tumescence or the fluid underneath the skin, and it the fluid will bathe the fat. Then the the probe from the Vaser machine goes in there and it shoots ultrasound waves into the fluid, and it bursts or destroys the adipocytes or fat cells um, and it really gets into every nook and cranny that you're working on as opposed to the standard liposuction machines that just use vacuum or the power assisted liposuction machine that um, just wiggles back and forth and sucks. This ultrasonic liposuction machine, if you could picture filling up uh, a part of the body with fluid and then sending out sound waves to really get into every little nook and cranny to dissolve that fat, it gets really gets everything out that you wanted to get out. Then we come back in and we use a power assisted to uh, take the fat out or to further contour areas that we want to get rid of. So that's one advantage is using the Vaser uh, ultrasonic lipo machine. The other advantage is that obviously there's um, we don't uh, it's less expensive. We don't charge for anesthesia or OR fees. We do have a, a, a small office fee that we charge for, but um, otherwise it's just the, the surgical fee. So those two advantages are enough to prefer doing something in the office if you're a good candidate for it. We often do um, fat grafting in the office. If you, if you have a lot of fat that we're taking out from the abdomen or the flanks and you would like that fat injected, um, either into the buttock region for a, a Brazilian butt lift or if you want it injected, if you have a, a defect of your breast tissue, you want it injected there or even if there are some people, people that want uh, larger calves, you can inject it into the calf uh, region to give more calf definition and volume. So um, we could always add that on to the end of the liposuction procedure where we harvest the fat, clean the fat, um, prepare it and then inject it where the person would want more volume. So starting from uh, going from head to toe, you could liposuction people that have heavy necks. So people that complain of double chins. We um, commonly make an incision behind the ear where you can't see it and then just inject fluid down here, fill this up with fluid, come back in and we do some liposuction. It defines the jaw uh, more and it also gets rid of all the fat underneath uh, the mandible, which is a great procedure. The other areas we do, we do um, the upper arms for people that have what's called bat wings or um, heavy arms. Uh, we could liposuction out the fat there. Um, we, we could uh, do any area in the torso, such as the abdomen, upper and lower abdomen, the flank area, and even the, the upper back and the lower back region. A lot of people complain about bra fat, that could be liposuction out. The inner outer thighs can be liposuction out. Even some people complain about uh, fat 
uh, that's hanging over their knees. That could even be liposuction now. So wherever you see a fatty deposit that doesn't appeal to you, that could all be liposuction now. The, the downtime really depends on how many areas and how large the areas are that we're liposuctioning. But if it's a small area, um, I would say that there's very, very little downtime. You could really go back to work um, the next day or the day after. If we're doing um, something that requires two liters of tumescence and we're taking out maybe a liter of fat, somebody might be a little sore, so you might want to just do that on a Thursday and then go back to work on a Monday. Um, you could really start exercising as soon as you feel comfortable. We do, uh, it is mandatory that you do wear a compression garment after the procedure so that there is no uh, asymmetry and the contour is nice and smooth. It also gets rid of the extra fluid. Usually the optimal result is after three months. Um, sometimes you see it right away, but usually it takes three months for all the extra fluid to leave the body and um, you see the, the final product at the three month mark. We also will sometimes recommend um, if the skin doesn't retract back, we'll recommend procedures that will tighten the skin such as radio frequency or micro needling, which will build the collagen and tighten the skin. That's good for the inner thigh area or even neck area. Um, we also recommend massaging the area that's liposuction so that everything's nice and smooth. So the other, the other advantage of the vaser is the, the vaser will not, um, does not damage any uh, vital tissue. It really focuses on the fat. Uh, the sound waves are at such a wavelength that the destruction is solely for the fat cells. It won't damage nerves or arteries or muscles. So there's very little bleeding using the vaser. Uh, that's another great advantage of using that machine. And again, uh, that's not a, they don't have that available in the hospital. We have it available in the office, which is a, a great advantage. So um, I hope this session was informative and please send us your questions and we'll uh, love to hear from you and answer any question that you have no matter how silly you might think it is it's usually not and we look forward to it thank you and have a good day